everyone. I hope you had a great day trading today. Today, I did find a new feature in TradingView, and it's not actually new, but I forgot about it for about five or six years. It actually used to be down here, and it's the bar replay feature, and I completely forgot about it. So going forward, uh, in, I, I'm going to be replaying the day from the close from the day before. So let's see if I can keep up with it. Um, so this morning we did gap down at open and we took it all the way down to the bottom of the implied move. And then from there we came back up above the one hour 200 moving average and tried to fill this gap that was opened first thing this morning. And we did get pushed back down away from that but bounced off of the one hour 200 average again and tried to fill it again. And we did get about, I'd say 40%, 35, 40% of the way closed. So there still is a gap open. So that is going to be resistance heading into tomorrow. All right, I guess that went pretty well. So let's go check out tomorrow's levels. So tomorrow's implied move from options is between 409 and 415. And to the upside, just above where we closed is this gap that we didn't close all the way today that we opened up yesterday. And if we get above that, then we have 414, which was last Wednesday, Friday, and then this past Wednesday, twice we tried to get above it and got pushed back down. And then above that, we have this gap from last Tuesday between 415 and 416. And that's at the very top of the trading range for tomorrow. And then to the downside, we do have the 30 minute to uh, 200 moving average that we have been chopping around. Uh, for about a week and then the one hour which has been catching it lately I almost want to do a replay of the one hour going back and I might do that in just a second and then at the bottom of the implied range just under the bottom of the range is 409 which was support this past Wednesday so Wednesday's entire move is the support and resistance in tomorrow's trading range and below that we do have this big support gap and a bear gap running through it so that looks like it might be a little bit of a a battleground if we get to that level and then the 50 ma is kind of peeking down at the bottom there and rsi is just kind of chopping around on many levels it's not really being helpful and so for that one hour, just because I'm now completely hooked on a replaying things, the one hour 200, we can start even right here. No, right there. So from the first place where we were kind of flying high above the one hour 200 moving average, and then we We, we tested it and it was support. And bounced off of it again here. We did close under it and then popped right back above. You can see that 414 resistance level. And then the one hour, it, it is getting consecutively less of a support so now we're just kind of clinging to it and I guess we'll see if it stays support or if we do move a little bit lower all right that is tomorrow's trading range I will publish this chart out on trading view if you want it and good luck trading tomorrow have fun trade safe and make sure you take profits when you're up see you tomorrow